Hello, hello. All right, everybody, I'm back. And guess what? We got the new Panini Chronicles draft picks 2022. Yay! New stuff. All right, um, 24 cards per box at Walmart. These things are 27.48. So you're at over a buck per card of Chronicles draft picks. Ugh. I was going to get three, put one back. So just two. Maybe I'll hit some of the guys we want to hit, a couple quarterbacks, and we're good. All right, check it out. Um, these things right here, the Blasters, they will have, what, the uh, Rookies and Stars or Legacy Rookie Base or Parallels. Um, I believe these are having to the Pink, Blaster Exclusive Pink Parallel. So we're going to get the pink ones. I got Aaron Rodgers as one of my pinks. Nice recon, David Bell. I'm guessing this is a pink as well. I have to compare it. Maybe I'll get another one of these types of uh, statuses to set, check it out. But I believe that's the pink as well. And, of course, this one, another recon. So, not the big dogs on those. But here we did get a couple base quarterbacks. Uh, Desmond Ritter. I'm not sure where he was drafted at. Um we got a third round pick, Malik Willis. And we got the only first round quarterback, Kenny Pickett in the rookie and stars. That's Pitt Uni. So we did get a few quarterbacks there, but I was always wondering, I was like, man, since when do they bypass the first quarterback? The only quarterback taken in the first round was Pickett. That was number 20 by the Steelers, right? That's why why isn't he with these guys on the cover? Or why isn't he replacing the third round pick? Why wouldn't it be Carroll and Pickett? Or throw Pickett in it. Why are they? Why they squeeze Pickett out of the cover? Did he want like money or something? I mean, what? How does that work? I don't even know. But I mean, yeah. And last year they weren't throwing Sam Enlinger and freaking Davis Mills on the cover instead of you know Trevor Lawrence and Trey Lance and Mac Jones and Justin Fields. You know what I mean? I, it, I don't know. It's just something that I thought about. Just baffled me. It's like who the who the hell made that decision and why? What was that based on? Anyway. Yeah, I can't figure that out. <laughs> I mean, I understand you want quarterbacks on the front. I get that. I just don't know why you cut out the only first round quarterback draft pick. That's, that's my issue. It's like, how did this guy get squeezed out of that picture? And why can't a wide receiver? I know you want offensive players, but even a defensive end. I mean, if I'm a first-round draft pick, who was a first-round pick? Trayvon Walker, then you got Hutchison, the two defensive ends, number one and two. Honestly, I think they could have they could have squeezed the first-round pick on in there as well. Why wouldn't you? The first overall pick. I mean, defensive ends get pretty good pub. I mean, I mean, look at freaking uh, Von Miller, dude. He had commercials running. J.J. Watt. Everybody knows who these cats are. I mean, they get to the quarterback, they get sacks. They, they're, they're popular, too. I don't understand. Oh, nice XR. Wow. This XR has a lot more pop than last year's XR. Now, last year's XRs were nice, but this has a lot of pop to it. I really like that. Nice looking card. Uh, there's that Mechie guy again. I don't know where he was drafted at. Heinz Ward, there's my first pink. You can barely see the pink right there. That John Mechie guy's been all over me. I don't know if I'm pronouncing his name right or wrong. I'm not a roll tide kind of guy. And then against him, Derek Stingley Jr.? Again, even these prestige cards. Like, I remember I did a lot of prestige retail, like regular, last year. And these things are just like, they're coded. I mean, differently. It's like they're a lot higher quality. A lot higher quality, I think. Uh-oh, there we go. Look at that one. Josh Allen, pink XR. I like that. Where's my sleeves? Oh, what I do with them? Man. I put them somewhere. Oh, well. Don't get scratched up, Josh. Nice looking freaking card. I 
Isaiah Spiller. I wonder if any in relation to CJ Spiller. And another Stingley college ticket. Nice looking card there, too. From Prism. Uh oh. Is that the pink? No, it's like a silver. Okay, this is a silver. I didn't get a silver in my first blaster. I did. I'll have to look back through and maybe I maybe I did. I just didn't realize it, but I don't think I did. We got a silver prism, silver hollow of Derek Stingley Jr., the third overall pick in the draft. Bumbling, stumbling, fumbling, fool. Nice. I don't have my sleeves right here. Did I use them all? No, I put them somewhere. Hmm. Shelf, maybe. You know, say I lose my, uh, you know what, if it wasn't attached. Christian McCaffrey. Ricky. Desmond Ritter again. The quarterback. And Pierre Strong Jr. Not familiar with this cat either. No pink. I get no pink. You know me, I love my pink. Keep it clean, boys and girls. Keep it clean. We got one pink so far, and we got a silver. I think the flash splasher, I got four pinks, so maybe it's not one per pack. Michael Vick. Look at that. Man, that brings back some memories. Whew. Long time ago. Oh, man. Another Ritter. I don't even know where he went in the draft. Figure as much pub as Cincinnati had all the momentum. There we go. There's the uh, number twentieth pick overall in the first round. A little on, a little too much this that way. But nice legacy rookie. Nice looking card. I'm liking these cards this year though. They are nice. That Matt Carroll one behind that, and that's your pink. Sweet. These do, they seem like they just look more crisp than what last year's Chronicles draft picks did. And I believe me, guys, I did a lot. I did like a, because last year's rookie quarterbacks, man. I did like a whole case of blasters. I probably did 20 blasters. I did a, uh, like a fat pack display because I wanted to do a, I love doing displays, right? So I did a whole fat pack display. It's a should videos all should be up. And I think I ordered that off of Target. And I did probably a few Megas too. And they they weren't as crisp as like these these cards right here. Like these, these the rookies and stars and these these ones right here. They weren't as crisp as these ones are. These ones look just these ones look, look really crisp. The quality is definitely there this year. No auto, unfortunately. Is that a pink? I think all the statuses are pinks. That's the way I think, right? Justin Jefferson. I think I have that card from last year. Same one, right? But it says rookie on it. Traylon Brooks. Uh, Brooks. Arkansas. Phoenix, is that what that is? Centering looks really nice. Nice staff from Bulldog. Uh oh, we got a backwards one. This is it going to be an auto? Our last pack. Get this Mechie guy again. Uh oh. Think so. What we got here? Dotson. It's going to be an auto. It is. Sweet. Defensive end of Iowa State as work. You was work work. I can't say his name. Use a worky. Let me see if I can find him over here. You guys want to join me on this? Let's see if we can find him over here. Uh, let's see how far he wasn't round one. E. Let's see how far down he is. Not round two. Round three? Come on, round three. Come on. Dude, I can't pronounce your name. 
round four. No, doesn't look like round four. Round five. Uh, doesn't look like round five. <laughs> Undrafted free agent. I wouldn't be surprised. Ooh. Here we go. Uh, nope, not round six. Come on, round seven. Did he get drafted? Um, no. <laughs> Are you kidding me? Come on, man. Oh, my goodness. Are you serious? Oh, Panini. I don't see this cat. If you guys see him, leave a comment down below because you know me. I'm going to move on and go off to the next. All right, guys. So uh, thanks for watching. Like, share, subscribe. Um, bye for now. And hey, we got auto out of retail. So that's pretty cool. Off to the next. Later.